But you know, this is not yeah. the first time the Supreme Court has tried to implement a continuous trial system. I recall when I was a new lawyer in the late 80s, they rolled this out already. Mm -hmm. And it, it didn't work. Uh, the intentions were very good, but it just wasn't, they didn't catch on to the judges. They, they had the problem, which is still a problem today. You know, we've, we've had the perennial problem with vacancies in the lower courts. Mm -hmm. During that time, almost one third of the trial court salas were vacant. And, uh, and now? Now that, that figure has gone down, but it's still big, it's 20%. Okay. And then we also have a problem with public prosecution positions, it's about 34% of them are vacant. Mm -hmm. So uh, the continuous trial system, I think, can only really work if we can also fill the vacancies. Mm -hmm.